world is going to be lower res than this world. This world will be the new reality base. I've had, quote, the out-of-body experiences. My influences have gone all the way from William Blake and uh, the Sex Pistols to a Cree medicine man who taught me so much. Boom, and I was hit with beams of light straight up into my eyes. Just because it's the voice of God doesn't mean to say it's right. Wow, wow, this is really high res. This is really high res, because this is another virtual world. Well, when I came into the uh, job at the Ministry of Defence, I was a complete skeptic. But then as I went through those three years, I began to realise that my view of the universe was, was not set in stone, and I had to change my mind on things. Instead of putting down the rave scene because it's so-called recreational use of drugs, as if there's something terrible about that, to realise what's happening there and that the euphoria and the, the fun and the, the sharing and the sense of community is deeply important to those people. There's paths out there and there's realities out there that we never get to explore. I don't like conformity. I don't like uh, uh, uniformity. I don't like fashion. There are people who have been unhappy with the appearance of the book, but has it actually interfered with my work? No, I still have my laboratory. The esoteric is becoming public. If you're a member of the human race, if you're a human species kind of person, you're a member of the first church of the last lap. We're radically inclusive. We include everybody. Deprogram. Decolonize thought.